Well, many of these have upcoming issues and uh, these are gonna be replacements he got for a good deal. Um, this was one that was installed by somebody else and the compressor went on it. It sounds like a bag of bolts inside a blender. Three phase system. Uh, and I did mention before they use half inch liquid line on this, not three eighths. They necked it down to three eighths right there, but he has half inch going back. I guess he wanted to sell a lot of extra refrigerant to make money and sell a lot of extra copper pipe at a higher price to milk the customer for money. Um, Got some little oil residue looky doos right there, and a little bit right there, maybe micro. We've got something going on there. And then right down here, you can see this one. We got that uh, copper to aluminum. You see how dark that is? And it has a little bit of shine to it. It hasn't had time to build up uh, oil on it. But I'm performing a recovery and uh, why do I have a heat gun down there at the bottom of the compressor if I'm uh, doing a recovery? But I'm doing the recovery. Gonna weigh what came out of this system. And uh, who knows, it could have been, you know, sometimes some guys believe they make up for leaks. I'll, I'll throw in an extra couple pounds because I'm tired of coming up here from whoever did it before. Don't know, but we'll find out. It's either low or high. I'm gonna cut out the compressor, remove the compressor and pour out the oil drill out the bottom to get every last ounce and I'm gonna measure how much oil comes out of this compressor compared to what the factory label says it should have in there so if the factory label says 38 ounces let's make it around there let's say it said hundred ounces of course it's not hundred ounces but if it had a hundred ounce system and you only pull out 10 ounces where's that other 90 ounces back down in the air handler in the coil now in this situation the air handler is located down below uh, two stories down and uh, 80 or 90 feet of line set and so we could have a situation where if I throw on the brand new unit we now have almost double the amount of refrigerant oil in the system that's no bueno so we're gonna take care of that if that's a problem and uh, if I have time I'll cut off the top and see if I could take this apart today or not. I don't know if I could get this done by the end of the day, but I'd like to show you the inside of what the scroll looks like uh, by the Sam. I think I released the video last week, maybe on this one, what it sounded like. And uh, we're gonna go from there. I'll see you guys. We got a lot of work to do here. Basically several of these units, they all have problems. Stuff needs to be modified, wasn't done right. And uh, I always could rely on other guys who have more experience than me to make more work for me. It's a good thing. See you guys.